myofascial release, myofascial release ball, tennis ball, kids lacrosse ball, dog's ball. Though the dog, you'll have to hide it because the dog will be crazy. It has to have some heft to it, some depth to it. Um, but let's talk about the hips. Deep hips, pain in your hips, sciatic pain, um, tension because you're sitting all the time and not moving enough. Great thing to do. A lot of times I show you lying down. Let me show you how you sit up. You're going to take the ball and I'm going to sit on it. Yep, that's right. I'm going to find a place on my hip and I'm just going to breathe and lean into that ball. That's all I'm going to do. Then I'm going to move it to another place and I'm going to lean into it. So now I'm, blah, I'm in the spot. My legs are bent, I'm really leaning back and in it. And I'm gonna go all over my hips. So you can do this on the ground. Don't do it on a sofa or a chair, it's too soft. And we need to kind of get in there. Do it on a floor with a mat. Um, but we wanna get into the different places in your hip. And especially as your hip, okay, your glute starts to go up into your lower back. The top region of the glute lower back takes a big hit. Why? Because look, I'm sitting most of the day. I'm sitting here so it's always compressed and um, it just gets really tight. So you want to loosen it up. So you're going to move it all different places on your hip and then you're going to go to the other side. But before you do, I want you to take a minute ooh, and just notice the sensations. Notice how you feel. Notice how much easier it is and then you're gonna to go to the other side you're gonna have one side that's tighter than the other maybe I'm gonna bend my knee I'm gonna put my other leg up and I'm gonna move it to different places so this is different than lying on your back you want to do it both lying down on your back and sitting up because it's a game changer it really ah uh, especially when we're doing all of these exercises to make our hips tighter and firmer and higher guess what they get tighter We've got to release it. Foam rolling, we've shown many ways of how you can foam roll the hip, but the ball gets in there very specifically. Ah, you want to get to another place, you're going to breathe and relax. And then you're going to notice, wow, that feels so much better. So try the ball. Um, and again, if you don't have one of these, email me, cpontero, P-O-N-T-U-R-O, at absolutepilatesupstairs.com and we'll get you a ball.